Listen, you cross-nation cheap steaks. Run for your life! I'm running for my life! No! A pie! A bomb? And we got paint on it! He's never let me live it down. I thought you said least. Closing time at the Krusty Krab. Five, ten, twenty-five, blue applesauce. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? What? The first time I ever made. I always keep it at the back of the register for luck. Well, I've never seen it. Hmm. Are you prepared to say that with your hand on a stack of interpretive dance quarterlies? Of course I'm. <laughs> what are you saying? One, you stole it. Two, you stole it. Or three, you stole it. I didn't take your precious dime. Show me your tentacles. <laughs> what? I quit. I'm out of here. Squidward, you're making a big mistake. Mistake? Ha! The only mistake I ever made was wasting my life at the Krusty Krab. Well, I guess I can't stop you. If you ever get in trouble, come find me. I'll take care of you. Because you and me, we're like brothers. Only closer. SpongeBob, I don't need your help. I am ready to unlock my potential. I can become anything I set my mind to. I could be a football player, or a king, or a spaceman. Next time you see me, this town will be eating out of the palm of my hand. Spare change. Spare change, ma'am. Squidward? Squidward, is that you? Uh, I, uh... It's me, SpongeBob. We used to work together. So, where are you living these days? Squidward tentacles? Yes? Sign here, please. Oh, uh, nowhere. I'm a loser! I've lost my job, my home, everything! Oh! <gasps> there, there. You can come live with me. Here you go, Squidward. You sleep in my bed. Okay, but just till I get a job. One day, two days tops. Nonsense. You stay as long as you need to. <sighs> Good night, Gary. SpongeBob, can I get a glass of water? Thank you. Good night. SpongeBob, can I get some more blankets? Here you go. Thank you. SpongeBob, you forgot to turn out the light. Good night. <laughs> Gary, Squidward is not a freeloader, and he would never take advantage of me. Three weeks later. He's just having a hard time getting his confidence back. <laughs> Many months later. I'm sure he's close to a breakthrough. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. <laughs> I know he still isn't looking for work. Don't rub it in. SpongeBob, where's my lemonade? And why aren't you in uniform? It's about time you got here! Four o'clock, time for my stories. Hurry up, they won't hold the show while you laze around. Hey, where you going? To my job! I'm not some lazy, inconsiderate jerk who lays in bed all day. Say, where can I get one of these jobs? Oh, they're everywhere, especially if you're green and have six tentacles. Thanks. I'm going to go look for one so I can stop mooching off my friends and they can get back to their lives. This isn't my show. SpongeBob, the remote control's broken. Get over here and fix it. i got a better idea. Why don't I call someone whose job it is to fix it? Because when I need a job done, I get someone with a job to do that job! What are you saying? Listen, you crustaceous cheapskates! Squidward's been living in my house driving me crazy! And you're not gonna hire him back all because of a stupid dime! What's that? <gasps> my first dime! This is a dime? I've been in business a long time, boy. So, if Squidward never stole the dime, he can come back to work, right? Aye, lad. 
Just let the diamond me have our privacy. <laughs> it's all water under the bridge now. I agree, sir. After all, I'm sure you didn't mean to misplace me dime. What the... What are you saying? Are you accusing me of something? Well, the way I see it, there are three possibilities. One, you put the dime in me pants. Two, you put the dime in me pants. Or three, you put the dime in me pants. Now, are you men ready for your super special secret assignment? Two of you are to paint the inside of me house! Yes! But let me give you two a warning. If I see even one drop on anything but wall, I'll have your rear ends cut off and mounted over me fireplace. So have fun with the job. Mr. Krabs sure has a lot of expensive treasures to drip paint on. Well, I guess we should open these cans of permanent paint now. <laughs> Careful, SpongeBob! Careful, SpongeBob! Careful, SpongeBob! Careful, SpongeBob! Careful, SpongeBob! Patrick, the lid's already off. Oh, now it's my turn. I'm thinking I should do this one too, Patrick. Okay, Patrick, let's get our brushes ready. Uh, maybe we should start with a smaller brush. All right, Patrick, gotta get started painting this wall. What could be worse than a giant paint bubble? Oh, I know. <laughs> Two giant paint bubbles. No! We did it. We painted the whole house and without getting a drop of paint on anything but the flap and flap. What's that? That's not just a dollar. It's Mr. Krabs' first dollar, his most prized possession. And we got paint on it. Okay, this isn't a problem. Maybe I can just wipe it off. <laughs> this is not good, Patrick. This is not good. Mr. Krabs is going to be home soon. And when he sees what we did to his first dollar... <laughs> Wait, SpongeBob. All we gotta do is wash the paint off and Krabs will never know. But Mr. Krabs said... Forget what Mr. Krabs said. Every paint comes off with something. <laughs> oh! Wait, SpongeBob. We're not cavemen. We have technology. It didn't work. This is all Mr. Krabs' fault. If he hadn't hung that stupid dollar in the first place, I mean, it's not like it looks any different than a regular dollar. Why hang it? You could just stick any old dollar bill up on the wall. No one would even know the difference. You might as well just reach into my wallet, pull out a dollar, and put it on the wall. And it would Hurry, Patrick, take out your wallet. I don't see where you're going with this. Hey, a dollar! Our butts are saved, Patrick. Now all we have to... Patrick, no! <laughs> Want a bite? Okay, okay, we still got time. What the? Hi, Mr. Krabs. SpongeBob, what are you doing? Oh, you know, just hanging around. Boo! Get down onto the floor, boy. No, 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 Mr. Krabs, no! Don't look at the trick. Did you two get paint all over me first, dollar? We're I'm so sorry, sorry. Mr. Krabs. There we go. Good as new. Yeah, I lied. This paint actually comes off with saliva. <laughs> oh, 
I get it, Mr. Krabs. You told us the paint was permanent so me and Patrick would be more careful and not get paint on anything. Nah, I just like to mess with you. <laughs> <laughs> I really gotta learn to say it, not spray it. Ah, finally, the weekend is here. And this isn't just any old weekend. This is the weekend SpongeBob and Patrick go camping. You've waited a long time for this. <laughs> what the? SpongeBob, aren't you two supposed to be camping? We are camping. SpongeBob, it's not camping if you're 10 feet from your house. No, oh, it doesn't matter where you are as long as you're outdoors. While all those soft city folk are safe in their beds reading books, we're out here pitting ourselves against the formidable forces of nature. I'll show you camping. Squidward's gonna come camping with us. Now you'll see how a real outdoorsman does it. Here we are, my remote-controlled self-assembling tent. Watch and learn. Uh, 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 huh? Customization! Genius! <laughs> He's tenderizing the ground! Of course! Write that down, write that down! <laughs> but what could compare to just lying out under the stars? Oh, God, that was incredible! After a long day of camping, it's nice to unwind with a nice, relaxing campfire song. I call this one the Campfire Song Song. Let's gather around the campfire and sing our campfire song. Our C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E-S-O-N-G song. And if you don't think that we can sing it faster, then you're wrong. But it'll help if you just sing along. Bum, bum, bum. C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E-S-O-N-G song. C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E-S-O-N-G song. And if you don't think that we can sing it faster, then you're wrong. But it'll help if you just sing along. C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E-S-O-N-G Good! It'll help! It'll help! If you just sing along! Oh, yeah! Ah, nah, wasn't that relaxing? No! This is relaxing! <sighs> I'll save you, Squidward! Squidward, are you all right? I was just fine until you launched that ballistic junk food into my windpipe! But I had to! It's too dangerous to play the clarinet badly out here in the wilderness! It might attract... a sea bear. A sea bear? You mean like the ones that don't exist? What are you saying? There's no such thing. They're just a myth. Oh, no, Squidward. Sea bears are all too real. It says so in the Bikini Bottom Inquirer. I should be more careful. In fact, why don't you tell me all of the things I shouldn't do if I want to keep the sea bears away? Okay, that's easy. First off, don't play the clarinet. Okay, then what? Never wear a sombrero. In a goofy fashion. Or clown shoes. Or a hoop skirt. And never. Ever. Ever. Ah! Screech like, like a, a chimpanzee. chimpanzee! Wow, it's amazing how many things can set a sea bear off. They're horrible! And, and suddenly, I have the sense we're all in danger. Why? I don't know. Just a feeling! No. Yes. No! <laughs> Squidward, Squidward, please don't! <laughs> SpongeBob, what are we gonna do? A sea bear is sure to come and eat us! Don't worry, Patrick. I'll draw us an anti sea bear circle in the dirt. Good thinking! All the experts say it's the only defense against a sea bear attack. 
<laughs> you guys are so gullible. See, I did everything that attracts a sea bear and nothing happened. Maybe it's because you're not wearing your sombrero in a goofy fashion. You mean like this? <laughs> no, like that. <laughs> Squidward, are you okay? No. Quick, jump inside our anti-sea bear circle before he comes back. Yeah, sea bears often attack more than once. Are you crazy? A dirt circle won't stop that monster. I'm running for my life. No! Ah! Sea bears hate that! Thanks for the tip. I guess I'll just limp home then. No! They hate limping more than running! Well, I guess I'll just have to. I should have warned you about crawling! What did I do that time? I don't know. I guess he just doesn't like you. Move over! Hey, it worked. You guys saved my life. Hooray! You did it! Hooray! Yeah, I'm glad it was just a sea bear. This circle would never hold back a sea rhinoceros. What attracts them? The sound of a sea bear attack. Huh, <laughs> good thing we're all wearing our anti-sea rhinoceros undergarments. <laughs> right, Squidward? <laughs> I saw it! It was big! It was all wiggly! And it ate everything! That's horrible! It was an Alaskan bullworm! I got it! Let's all buy a Krabby Patty! We should take Bikini Bottom and push it somewhere else! That idea may just be crazy enough to get us all killed! What's wrong with you? Catch your worm for you? That is, if and you're willing to pay. No! You'll never get a cent out of me! Never! I'd rather that worm come in here right now and eat you all alive! <laughs> <laughs> Aw, oh, shucks. I don't want your money. I was just playing up the drama of the moment is all. <laughs> nope, I'm gonna take that spineless critter down for nothing, cause this is personal. Look, my tail's gone. <gasps> Karma must have got it while I had my back turned. The coward. I am gonna get back what's mine. But Sandy, you don't know what you're up against. We're talking about an Alaskan bullworm! Well, I don't know nothing about Alaska, but looky here. Back in Texas, I wrangled bulls and I wrangled worms. Far as I'm concerned, doing them both together just saves rope. Now I'm gonna go kick me some worm tail. Yee-haw! But Sandy, you don't know. We have the utmost confidence in you. <laughs> now what was that idea of yours? Push! Ah! <laughs> Wait! Sandy! Hey, SpongeBob! You coming to watch? Sandy! Don't go! Why not? Sandy, I saw it! It's big, scary, and pink! What you think is big and what I think is big are two totally different bigs. Besides, he's got my tail. I can't take that sitting down. Okay, but what if the worm didn't take your tail? If that worm ain't got my tail, who does? Um, I do. You do? Where? Uh, in my pocket. <laughs> well, why didn't you just say so? Give it here. Come on. Oh. Mm. 
SpongeBob, that's a paperclip, and a piece of string. How would you know? It's always behind you! There ain't nothing too big or too ornery for me to catch. Okay. Say it! There isn't anything. Ain't nothing! Ain't nothing too big or too ornery for you to catch. But that! But that! And don't! Worm sign. He's in that cave. Sandy, are you sure you... Of course I am. I'm going in, and I ain't coming out till I got me a big heaping plate of worm stew. <laughs> Aha! There you are, you tail-nabbing varmint! And as you can see, no worm is a match for me. I haven't found my tail. That's not the worm. Pardon? That's not the worm. That's his tongue. Oh. This is the tongue. And the whole thing is the worm. Run for your life! <laughs> So what's the plan, Sandy? Run faster! I guess I have that. Hey, wait a minute! I was right, wasn't I? Can we talk about this some other time? Say it! SpongeBob! Say it or I'll trip you! No! You were right and I was wrong! I was wrong, 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 wrong! Are you happy now? I knew it. <laughs> Uh, Sandy? Yeah? What do we do now? <laughs> I got it! SpongeBob, you still got that paper clip and that string? I'm way ahead of you, Sandy. Look, it's a necklace! S for SpongeBob, or S for Sandy. That way they can identify our body. No, silly! How about S? Save our skins! We'll be nice and safe up here. We did it! He'll never get out of there! We saved the town! Yay! Let's go tell everybody! Mr. Squidward. So, are you ready? To go home? No, to exchange gifts for Employee Brotherhood Day. Squidward, in honor of Employee Brotherhood, I present to you a gift. Ta-da! I heart you. It's a little itchy. What's this thing made of? Eyelashes! Now, may I resume my minimum wage duties? After you present your brotherhood gift. I'll buy the little twerp a gumball. Oh, no, 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 lad. You know the rules. You have to make the gift. The only thing I'm making is for the exit. Is this any better, Squidward? I made this one with my tears. <laughs> I knew you'd come around, boy. If you drop one single slice of me booty, I'll have... Your booty! Those uh, homemade pies sure look good. Oh, these aren't homemade. They were made in a factory. A bomb factory. They're bombs. Oh, well, that's too bad. I thought they were pies and I wanted to buy one. Wait! Uh, we were just kidding about all that bomb stuff. That'll be 25 bucks, please. Okay, here it is, Mr. Krabs, fresh from the oven. I'll be returning to my life now. Not yet. I gotta make sure you did it right. Wait a second. This would go great with some milk. Whoop. So, you 
tried to kill me over a little New Age management, eh? But, Mr. Krabs, I had no idea. I can explain. Mr. Krabs, are you okay? I heard a wow! A pie! It's from Squidward to SpongeBob. Well, here you go. And that's what happened? $25? A bomb? In, In the, the Krusty Krab! <laughs> Thanks for the pie, Squidward. When that pie goes up to bat, I mean, hits his lower intestine, boom! The way I see it, he's only got until sunset. Why ruin his last day on Earth? The lad deserves to enjoy his final hours. SpongeBob? Yes? I forgot to tell you there's a part two to your gift. Part two? Part two, part two, part two, part two. Uh, uh, please don't do that. What's for part two? Well, what's the most fun thing you can think of? Actually, I keep a list of the most fun things I like to do. Knock, knock jokes. Hey, Squid, knock, knock. Who's there? <coughs> I am Bob. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Oh, yeah. Look out, everyone! Friends in reverse! Boop, boop, boop! Are you sure you should be poking it like that? Who is the doctor here? Da, da, da. <sighs> Underwater sunsets sure are beautiful, eh, Squidward? Yeah. Yeah. This is great. Just the three of us. You, me, and this brick wall you built between us. Yeah. <laughs> Sunsets always remind me of bowls of fruit. What do they make you think of, Squidward? Explosions. I, I mean, uh, e erosion. You know, if I were to die right now in some sort of fiery explosion due to the carelessness of a friend, well, that'd just be okay. <laughs> 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 Wow, it feels like something just dropped into my lower intestine. Here it is, the sunset! I always love to count it down. Five! You do the rest, buddy! Uh, four, three, two, one. I guess we started too early. Let's start again. Five, four, three. <laughs> well, at least I was able to make his last few hours meaningful. I am such a good person. Hey, Squidward, check this out. Why are you still here? Well, since we finished everything on the list, I thought I'd make up a new one. I already filled up this book with ideas. I spent the whole day with you doing all kinds of ridiculous things because you were supposed to explode! You want me to explode? Yes! That's what I've been waiting for! You're supposed to explode into a million pieces! Why would I do that? Because the pie you ate was a bomb! What pie? The one I left sitting on the counter this morning that I bought from Pirates for 25 bucks and I didn't know it was a bomb and you ate it. That pie! Pie. Oh, you mean this pie. I was saving it in my pocket for us to share. Let's eat. Oops. It's a game! The Flying Dutchman's Treasure Hunt. Based on a real treasure map. Take a break and play around with us. Fish eyes. One, two. You are a real pirate. Go straight to the X which marks the spot. You get to dig for treasure, Mr. Krabs. There it is! It's the Flying Dutchman's Treasure! Go, 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 go! My, 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 my. This is my kind of game. Hooray! Six! One, two. I win again! Oh, that's 17 times in a row! I think we ought to call it a night, Mr. Krabs. I'll see you tomorrow. Avast! Pineapple Ho! Heave to and 
prepare to be boarded! Ah, uh, go home already. And this is no game! We're gonna be pirates! Pirates? Aye! How'd you like to go on a real treasure hunt with a real treasure map? Treasure? Keep a sharp lookout, SpongeBob! According to the map, we're close to the first landmark! Really? Can we see the map? Uh, no! Only the captain can lay eyes on the map! Okie dokie, then! Arr, a pirate doesn't say, Okie dokie, then! A pirate says, Arr! Captain, we're about to hit the... I mean, Arg! Cap, Arg, we're Arg about Arg to hit Arg! Out with it, man! Arg! Arg, Arg, think Arg! He's trying Arg to say... Land. Arg! From now on, only the captain says Arg! Our treasure hunt will have to continue on foot. This is it, boys! From the seaweed with two leaves on it, 10,000 paces east. But, Mr. Krabs, that seaweed has... Which way, Cap'n? And St. Patrick, which way is east? Uh, let's see... That way, Cap'n! 9,997, 9,998, 9,999, 10,000. Where's the X? It's supposed to be right here. 10,000 paces east. Oh, east? I thought you said weast. Weast? What kind of compass are you reading, lad? This one, sir. That's west, Patrick. 9,551, 9,552. Mr. Krabs. We're tired. And hungry. Without a loyal crew, what am I captain of? Just a bunch of sand. <laughs> Don't cry, Captain Krabs. Yeah, we'll be your loyal crew. <laughs> <laughs> You'll stay with me then? We'll, we'll be, be the, the most, most loyal pirate, pirate crew ever. ever. One for all. And all for one. I'm so loyal, I don't want to sleep till we find the treasure. Let's see if the captain will go now. Captain, captain Krabs! He's not here. Look, the treasure map. Only the captain can look at the map, Patrick. Yeah. Patrick, what are you doing? I'm not looking, I'm touching. There's no rule against that, is it? No, guess there isn't. Oops! Patrick, it opened by itself. Ah! <laughs> the map, the map, the map. I gotta see it. I gotta look at it to see if I'm onto it. SpongeBob. Yeah. Did you notice something familiar about this map? You mean like that it's our game board taped to a piece of paper? Do you think this is a problem? That's mutiny on my ship. So you think old Captain Krabs has gone crazy, do you? Not at all, Captain Krabs. We don't think that at all. I think that. I'm gonna throw you overboard for saying that. <laughs> Look. Well, what are you waiting for, lads? Dig! Dig! We've got it, Captain Krabs. <laughs> Hand it up to me, lads. Jeez. We finally found it. The Dutchman's treasure! Wow! What are you gonna do with your share, Patrick? I don't know. How are you gonna spend your share, SpongeBob? What shares? You're not getting any of my treasure! What about loyalty? All for one! And one for all! All for one! And one for all! All for one! Who dug up the Dutchman's treasure? Ladies! So you two scallywags dug up me treasure. Well, you saved me a lot of digging, you did. So here's a reward for the two of yous. Wow! Two gold doubles! Wait! I'm captain of this crew. Where's my reward? A little something for your trouble. Gold, 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 gold. Huh? It's just a little plastic treasure chest. Plastic! Aye, but it's based on a real treasure chest. <laughs> Gee, Mr. Krabs, you're looking all sweaty again. I hate Krabby Patties. Ah, 
good one, Squidward. You know what we say. The only people who don't like a Krabby Patty have never tasted one. That's me. Never had one, never will. No wonder you're always so miserable. Here, try this. Try one of those radioactive sludge balls you call food? But it's good for you. Good for you? That thing is a heart attack on a bun. No, Squidward, I meant good for your soul. Oh, please. I have no soul. <laughs> You won't be sorry. No! It's delicious. Listen, SpongeBob, how long are you prepared to keep this up? Give me that. When I die, you stay away from my funeral. Um. This Krabby Patty may be the most horrible, putrid, poorly prepared, vile, unappetizing, disgusting excuse for a sandwich it has ever been my displeasure to have slithered down my throat, and I curse this Krabby Patty to an early and well-deserved grave! Get it? But it doesn't make any sense. The Krabby Patty is an absolute good. Nobody is immune to its tasty charms. Nobody but me. Are you sure? Does this look unsure to you? No. Good. Now go spread the word. Come on, come on, come on. Still alive. <laughs> <laughs> so delicious! All the wasted years! I gotta have more! <laughs> but wait! After that performance, he'd never let me live it down. I gotta sneak one. Just one. Then I'm off the stuff for good. SpongeBob? Yes, Squidward. I need a triple Krabby Supreme on a kelp bun with extra sea pickle and... And burn it to a crisp, okay? Coming right up! Listen, Squidward, I want to apologize for before. I was only trying to make you happy. And I was trying to make myself happy. But now I've learned there's room for all kinds of people in this crazy world. And they don't all have to like the same thing. Don't go. Triple Krabby Supreme! Triple Krabby Supreme! Did somebody order a Triple Krabby Supreme? Huh, they must have left. Well, uh, why don't you just, uh, leave it out here in case they come back? Nope! A patty this special should be eaten fresh, and... Well, I haven't had one of these babies in over 20 minutes, so... <laughs> <laughs> well, whoever they were, they had great taste. Ah, <laughs> oh, they don't know what they're missing. Well, back to work. What? Oh. I have got to get my hands on a Krabby Patty, and no one's gonna stop me! There it is. Holy shrimp! I don't know where to start. But all that matters is that it's just you, and me, and nobody... Squidward? Is that you? SpongeBob, uh, uh, uh... What are you doing here? I always come to work at 3 a.m. What are you doing here? God, uh, I forgot my... Uh, and why is the patty vault open? Oh, I thought that... Uh, and why are you holding a patty behind your back? I... 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 I, I no, I, I didn't do... Just, and why uh, are you acting so nervous? And why are you sweating so much? And why do you look so hungry? And... No, no, wait. It's not what you think. This is a big misunderstanding. You've got to believe me. I... 
Listen, I am telling you, you better listen to me, SpongeBob. You like Krabby Patties, don't you, Squidward? Yes! Yes! I admit it, SpongeBob. I love Krabby Patties. <laughs> What's gonna happen? Am I gonna blow up? No, worse! It'll go right to your thighs! <laughs> My thighs? And then you blow up! Yeah, <laughs> I remember my first Krabby Patty. Yeah.